Hey guys, how's it going? Nuki here, and today I have for you some garage sale pickups from this weekend, which is the last Saturday of August. What did I say? The 30th? August 30th, yes. Um, so today I found a fat PS2. Um, it's in good condition. It works. Uh, it came with three controllers. Two uh, PlayStation 2 memory cards, or Sony memory cards, uh, eight megabytes each. Um, this controller, which it's missing one of the tops for the the thumbstick, and this controller, which I just noticed has a gouge in the wire. Nice, uh, I didn't see that before. And this controller, which has its no gouges. Uh, they all work. There's nothing wrong with it. And then, um, oh, the power cord and the AV cable also came with that. And then there was the the online startup disc came with it. Madden 2004. Namco Museum. Guitar Hero 3. Tiger Woods PGA Tour 2005, World Championship Poker, Medal of Honor European Assault. Um, this is Call of Duty Finest Hour inside. These are all complete except for this one, of course. Um, Midway Arcade Adventures 2. There's something on that case. I don't even want to think about what that could be. Um, Guitar Hero 2. Or is that 3? No, it's 2. Another one was 3. Um, then there's World Series of Poker, um, Grand Theft Auto, the trilogy, all the games inside are in great condition. The only thing that's wrong with this is the box has some wear, the outside sleeve. Uh, the Sims 2, Capcom Classics Collection, Super Monkey Ball Deluxe. This was actually um, a black label God of War, but I traded it because I needed a black. So I gave, I traded out for the greatest hits. And then God of War 2, greatest hits. That was all $25. So yeah, that was the PS2, the controllers, the two memory cards, all the games. And hookups with the PS2, $25. And then, let's see. Thanks. And then, last weekend, I found this PS2. Um, this was a filthy, dirty, disgusting little ball of filth. And um, the lady had a $5 tag on it. And it did come with a controller, but it's scattered somewhere because this was last weekend. I did last weekend's video twice, accidentally deleted it twice, and then just gave up. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so PS2, uh, $5, it was a filth ball. I cleaned it up. Um, well, let's get back to the beginning. I asked her, it was all, it was really filthy, and it had a $5 piece of, like, tape that was, like, hardly sticking to it because the the PS2 itself was so dirty, and it had five dollars on there, and it came with it one controller, and hookups. And I said to her, "I are you firm on the on this price?" And she's because I, I have a little bit of a hard time talking people down sometimes. And she said, "Well, uh, yeah, I want I want the five dollar, you know, I want five for it." She didn't want to budge. So then I looked at her and I said, "Well, does it work?" And she goes, she kind of looks at me. She goes, "Well, I don't know." And then she paused again, and she goes, $2. I said, okay, cool. So I bought it for $2, brought it home, cleaned it up real good, and it works perfectly. Um, so, yeah, that, I thought that was pretty good. $2 came with a controller that's worn, but it works really well. There's nothing wrong with it. It doesn't stick. It, it works great. Um, and the power cord was there and the AV cable. So I thought that was pretty damn good for $2. And then, going back to today... I had some games last week too, but you know, I I don't know. I've sold a lot of it. A lot of it's already gone. I don't even remember everything I got to tell you the truth. Um so these are demo discs from the Xbox magazine. And that's this uh 
number six with what is it? Gun Valkyrie. Number seven with Dead or Alive three. Number eight with Spider Man. Uh, number nine, Crazy Taxi three, High Roller. Number ten is Time Splitters two. Um, number thirteen has Splinter Cell and Panzer Dragoon. Um, number fourteen has Blinks. Uh, fifteen has a Battle Engine Aquila, Ghost Recon. Uh, number nineteen has Tao Fang, Fist of the Lotus. Number 20 is NBA Street Volume 2. Number 21, Mace Griffin, Bounty Hunter. Um, number 23, Voodoo Vince. Number 24 is Prince of Persia. Number 25 is Rainbow Six Three. Number 26 was Project Gotham Racing. And number 28 was 007 Everything or Nothing. And then this one is a demo disc that I got at the same place. It is not an Xbox One, um, or excuse me, it's not an Xbox Magazine demo disc, but it's for Metal Arms Glitch in the System. So I don't know where they got this, but it says on the back, not for sale. And to be quite honest with you, I like messing with these these demo discs. I love demo discs because that's about the length of my attention span, just enough to play and get a taste, and that's about it. Oh, here's a game from last week, uh, Left 4 Dead. And I also got, it's just a disc only copy from last week, and I also got Splatterhouse and Capcom, Mortal Kombat versus Capcom, or I don't know. It's Mortal Kombat and DC Universe, I don't know, something, something crazy. I had fun with it. I played with it, and then I don't know what I did with it. It's here somewhere. And then there's, I got this last weekend too, Trivial Pursuit. These are both like uh, I think a buck a piece or something. Oh, so getting back to this deal, because I didn't have these stacked right. At this garage sale, I also got um, Midway Arcade Treasures, Halo Combat Evolved Platinum Hits, PS2 Grand Theft Auto Vice City, back to Xbox Ghost Recon 2, um, Ghost Recon Advanced Warfighter. Um, Brothers in, in Arms, Road to Hill 30. Um, the classic trilogy of Tom Clancy. It's got Ghost Recon, Splinter Cell, and Rainbow Six Three. All of these are complete. Um, for all of this, I paid $17. Paid $0.50 cents a piece for these. In fact, I th think she gave me $0.50 cents off. Woo, but anyway. Yeah, and then a dollar each for these. And then, oh yeah, this came with the PS2. How could I forget? It's not, I think, I've never used one of these. It's not complete, I don't believe. Because there's supposed to be like a code chip or something in here, right? I don't know, maybe you guys can tell me. So the disc is here, and then... Let me pop it in. Oh, open here, that's all that's in there. And I think there's supposed to be like some kind of chip or something that you've got to the, to the PS2. I don't know. I've never used one of these, so I'm not, I don't know. So anyway, yeah, that's what's there. That's that. And, wait, I'm missing something. Oh, yeah, okay. So, yeah, that Game uh, Shark was part of the $25 PlayStation 2 pickup from today. Another garage sale, I got Cars, Mater, Mater National, Speed Race of the Video Game, Carnival Games, and these are all for DS. Complete. Well, no, this one doesn't have a book. Uh, Harry Potter. Lego Harry Potter. Years 5 to 7 for the 3DS. And then we have... God, I, I can't even read that. What is this? Will it, will it focus? Yes, it will. Big Mother Truckers. Game chip only. Um, the Pirates of the Caribbean. At... Land or at World's End. These are really hard to read because they're so little. Uh, chip only. And Harry Potter years Lego Harry Potter years one through four. Chip only. And I got those for thirteen dollars. I think it was. That was thirteen. So, um, yeah, that's that. That's my pickups for this weekend and a few from last weekend. Oh, last weekend I also got a copy of. 
Halo... The first Halo? I think it was the first Halo. Oh, yeah, and then this week, also, in this lot, there was a Halo 2, but it's already sold in its package to go out. So, yeah. So that was part of this. The Halo 2 is part of this. And then the Halo 1 from last week is also gone. And that's it. Sorry, guys. I'm kind of flighty-headed today. But anyway, yeah. So that's my pickups for August 30th. And the month is over already. It's gone by really quick. So we're entering, entering September. And hopefully some of my garage sale luck will hold out for the next few weeks. It would be great. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, as always. And please like, comment, and subscribe.